Hi, I'm Chris Ryan, uh, one of the teaching pros here at the Belfry. Uh, I've been here for over 10 years, and we're down here at the PGA National Golf Academy. Uh, and I'm going to give you a tip on, on driving, uh, more specifically the setup of the driver. Now, the driver is the one club that we get a lot of people walking through the door saying they struggle with, they want more consistency, they want more distance, that kind of thing. And what we tend to see is a lot of the problems they have are already present at setup. So before they even move the club away, they've not really created the right positions. So, what we often tend to see with the driver is a setup where the ball position may be correct but they have the hips too far to the right or too far back and what that does it puts the, the spine tilted slightly towards the target okay now this is a very very common setup uh, mainly because the ball's a bit further forward and the right hand is a bit lower than the left they tend to reach over for it this way and create these positions now that starting position those body angles will tend to create a steeper angle of approach so the club tends to work more downwards and we often find from here that the golf club will tend to work more to the left of target. Now the shots we would see from there would be shots which go straight left, so a pull, shots that curve to the right, i.e. slice, and often ones that come off the sort of the top edge of the club that go straight up in the air, not very far, and sometimes we get a divot. So what we actually want to do is take a starting position, and the front hip wants to be a little bit more forwards and a little bit more up than the back hip. What that will do is it'll put my side tilt in like this. So my right shoulder is a bit lower, my spine is tilted away from the target. Now those starting positions tend to encourage the club to work more upwards and more out to the right. Now the data capture that we use tells us that when the golf club works upwards as it hits the golf ball, that tends to give us better launch conditions, better ball flights, more distance. Now most people would pretty happily take those. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a normal starting position, feet this far apart, place the club in, place your right hand on your right hip, and very simply just bump the hips a little bit more towards the target. Okay, That puts us in, as I said, much better hip alignment, much better upper body alignment, and much better spine tilt. Okay, So I'm going to show you that setup, and I'm going to give this ball a hit and see if we can get those positions that we spoke about. So good setup, hips go a little forward, and then from there, give it a hit. Okay, so if we try those positions, get a good setup, and hopefully we'll get more consistent drives, longer drives, and find more fairways. Thank you.